This video is for code.org lesson 12 keyboard input. Um, first, what you're going to do is I'm going to recommend that you click on where it says show text. That's just going to make it easier to be able to copy and paste some code to be able to change it so that we make our bug move up, down, left, and right. Okay, so what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put my pointer on these three little dots right here and I'm just going to drag upwards so that I have lots of room for my code. Okay, so then what I'm going to do is I'm going to click and drag to select um, lines 8 through 12, just like this. I'm going to hit Control c on my keyboard to copy it. Then from here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to click after the curly bracket. I'm going to go ahead and hit Enter on my keyboard and then hit Control and V on my keyboard. So as of right now, the code is the same, but we're just going to change it a little bit. So now we're going to say if the left arrow is pressed, move the sprite left on the screen. And now we're going to say if key down instead of right, we're going to say left. And then we're going to make it so that the bug x is subtracted by 5 since we're going toward the 0. Okay, so then from here what you're going to do is you're going to click after the last curly bracket, going to hit enter, and then control V again to paste. We're going to change it this time so that if the up arrow is pressed, move the sprite up on the screen. We're going to change it so that it says if key down, up. And then because up and down controls our Y position, we're going to change where it says bug X so that they both say bug Y. Now, because of the fact that zero is at the top, so taking a look, like Y right now is at four, zero is at the top, so we're actually going to subtract our Y when we're moving up. So we're going to change the plus sign to a minus sign. Then we're going to click after the last curly bracket, hit enter one more time. And then from here, you're going to hit control V again. And then we're going to change this code so that it says if the down arrow is pressed, move the sprite down on the screen. And so then if key down, we're going to change that so that it says down. And then again, we're going to change it so that it says bug Y. So just get rid of the X, change it to a Y. And then in this case, um, if the key down, bug Y plus 5, because again, 400 is at the bottom. So when we move from top to bottom, we are adding Y position. Um, and so then we're going to just reset and run to make sure that that works. And so from this point, if you move your arrow keys, it should move up, down, left, right, and that's it.